Hello everyone. In this video we will discuss about the process and how process communicating with each other. So before development any network application we need to know what is process. The process is a instance of a program running in a computer or we can say that process is a program under the execution. So let's take an example. You have already studied programming in C language and you have studied lots of C programs. In this program you need to run this program first you need to compile and then execute this program. After execution you have displayed the hello world word. Hello world. So the execution of this program is nothing but execution of particular process. So we can say that the process is a instant of program running in any computer or we can say that this process is a program under execution. So this program or this process running in any machine or host. So when process are running on the same host or same end system they can communicate with each other. In this example the process 1 and process B, process A and process B are communicate with each other in same host machine. So it communicate with each other with inter process communication. Using this rule that are governed by the end system operating systems. So we can say that the same host and two process communicating using this two process communication it is a inter process communication in same host. Let's see if different host. So the process on the two different host or two different end system communicate with each other by exchanging the message. See in this figure the process P1 in host 1 and process P2 in host 2. It communicate with each other and exchanging the message it is also possible when the host is different. So in this con context of the communication session between the pair of the process the process can initiate the communication it is called a client. Again I repeat in context of the communication the session between the pair of the process that is communication is called a client. The process that wait to be contacted to begin a session is a server. See the client process a process that initiate the communication and the what is server process the process that wait to be contacted by client process. So we can say that a client is a process or program that send a message to server program and requesting that the server perform a particular task and at the server side a server is a process or program that fulfill the request of the client by performing this task requested by a client. So server program generally received a request from the client program and execute it and dispatch the response to the client request. Let us see socket. The socket is nothing but any of the message sent from one process to the another and it is must go through the underlying the network. So we can say that a process send a message into or received a message from the network through any software interface it is called a socket. Let's take real time example. A process is similar to a house and its socket is similar to its door. So when a process want to send a message, a process want to send a message to another process on another host it pass the message out of the door. 
end. This sending process assume that there is transmission providing facility out of the door. This transportation facility or transportation infrastructure on the other side of its door that will transport the message to the door of destination process here. So the message to the door of the destination process once the message arrived at destination side at destination host door the message passed through the receiving process door or we can say socket and the receiving process then act on that message. So in that we can say that the process is a home or socket is a door. Any of the message if process want to transmit to destination process at that time sending a process pass message out of the door. So, we need to pass this process through transportation infrastructure to destination side and at the destination side through the door or we can say through the socket the message is now at destination process and this receiving process act on the particular message. Let's take this example in our networking layers. See, in application layer, lots of application are available. This application want to send message to further layers. So, they can send a message from process or we can say this is the process through a socket. So, socket is a door and process is a particular program of layer. See, in this example, socket is here and this is application which is controlled by application development and other layers are controlled by particular operating system. Thank you.